Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven? Let us go ahead over here doing ranked one v one. Hold on. All right, all right, all right. We're playing Al Kwong today because so many people have wanted to see attack speed Al Kwong, especially in the comments of yesterday's video when I mentioned the Samurai Jack thing. Everyone thought um, Al Kwong would make a good Samurai Jack, and you're so right. And I forgot about it, dude. I forgot, but. Oh, I just pressed the wrong button. Watching a video here in the background? Hell yeah, gamer. Um, But yeah, you guys are so right, man. He would make a good Samurai Jack. Anyways, thank you all for the support, man. All the subs and everything recently. We're, we're getting a lot of love, honestly. Like, I can't, I can't thank you guys enough. Thank you so, 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 so much. For all the support. He outclears me a lot, but I'm I'm not gonna double buff because I feel like I don't need to. I'm just gonna try to clear the back line here. Alright, well he does actually outclear me a lot, but he didn't pick up his buff. I guess he wants blue buff, but but I don't know. Nice. Oh, I wonder if he thought I was going to be there. I'm pretty close to level 5. I will hit level 5 off this wave because I did double buff. At least I think that's how it works. Nice. Good first blood. Good first blood. Good job, man. But yeah, anyways, um, put a lot of support recently. Um, you know, not necessarily in viewers or subs, but just in the comment section, all the positivity that you guys are sending to me and, um, you know, all the congrats on the move and the new setup and all this new stuff. I just, you know, thank you guys so much. It's, it's, it's really nice because it's really, really rare to have such a positive community online. Um, and it's very nice that, that we have as, you know, as a whole collectively turned what honestly used to be a pretty toxic community into the most positive one in, in Smite. So I'm super happy. I'm super grateful. Thank you guys so much. And yeah, that's all I really wanted to say was just my appreciation to you all. I wasn't going to use an ability here, but it looks like he's not showing up, so no biggie. Ooh, I kind of want to ult him. But I don't know if I can get close enough. I mean, I am definitely like, he's in range to get ulted. 100%. Problem is, if I use my one to get close, I no longer have the mana to ult him. So. You know what, dude? He got some good poke. Ow. Fine by me. Fine by me, brother. I'm gonna back. Let's go get my blue buff. I actually do want to pick it up. I feel like my mana is a bit of an issue. Because my three is on a really low cooldown, and I need to be spamming it to poke him down enough. Thankfully, he's not going lifesteal, which would be terrible for me. Because Alquang... Alquang is all about all-inning, right? But then if he survives the all-in... And then he just life steals up. I'm, I'm so screwed. <laughs> so, so thankfully he's going like a fighting build. Like he wants to counter all in me, and I don't think that's possible against Aquang. If I'm completely honest, he got it. I wanted to try to get that from him. Let's see.
Alright. I did miss the two there, but... The reason I used my stuff there, or my alt there, was... Hold on, I really don't want to get hit by that too. There we go, nice. The reason I ulted that was for CC immunity. I probably could have just beads it and maybe won that fight, but uh, it's risky. He's got health pots ticking. I'm a little scared. Oh my god, he does so much damage. Damn. I really needed to... Um, for, for that fight, I really needed to lifesteal a little bit more, and I didn't have boots finished. Unfortunately. Man, mana is the one thing holding me back. Every fight, it seems. Maybe I should just, like, not use my three as often. Maybe that's my issue. Maybe my issue is just the fact that I'm kind of spamming abilities and I can't be doing stuff like that. I don't know. I don't play out Kwong, so I'm, you know, I'm trying to learn him a little bit. When he first came out, I went 75 and 0 on him. Like, I, I really fragged out, but... Oh, what? Why didn't my ult kill him? I didn't know he could auto attack while being CC'd by the ult. I thought you were. I thought it was a CC. I guess you learn something every day, man. I guess you learn something every day. I don't know. Try harder, meme. Bro. I <laughs> picked out Quang. <Kwong. laughs> Alright, let's, um... Man, that really is kind of shitty, to be honest. I wish... It CC'd. That kind of ruins my game plan. <laughs> my game plan was to, to beads his ult. Like, in the later fights, was to just beads his ult and... And then just ult him. Like, execute style. But... Seems as though I cannot do that. And that's a pretty butts. Um It's pretty tough to get close to him, honestly. Alright, I'm back in. I really think Blink is the play here. And I'm also going to get XE because he's going into um, defense right now, so. Or not XE. I mean, it's 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 literally XE, but it's demonic grip. Like, it's the magical version of Executioner, basically. Except it's better now because they nerfed Executioner. And they didn't nerf demonic, so. He heals so much. Your middle tower is under attack. Oh, nice. I really was not sure if that was going to do enough damage to kill him. I was really worried that wasn't going to do enough damage to, to put him in execute range. But thankfully it did. That's pretty big. Pretty big. I've got a lot of attack speed, so we should be able to take this tower. And I'm gonna have to go defense, because he is hitting super, duper, duper, duper hard. Hmm. 
Let's see, what's his defensive? Is it Pestilence or Bulwark? Pestilence, okay. Right call in my opinion. Let's go grab Breastplate. And a couple of, a couple of potions. A couple of potions. You got beads for the execute. Another smart play. Let's see, did he go straight to Bull Demon? Because that's what I would have done. Nope, okay. Alright, so I knew he was going to beads if I tried to execute, so basically what I'm doing is... Basically what I'm doing is just trying to fight him. Um, and I'm going to... I use my alt as the... I forget what it's called. Initiator, because it does damage. That's pretty much it. And I don't want to be really far behind in the fight. I want to go to Bull Demon, but I feel like... Nice. Nice, nice, nice. He's only dead 20 seconds, so it's not enough... Um, not enough time to push wave and get Phoenix. So we're going to just try. I don't know if I can do this. I definitely cannot do it. Damn. It's really, really bad. Really bad. Um, by the way, somebody noticed in a previous video that I... When I bought Hide of the Nemean against a Kernanos, I think I was fighting Rexy at the time. And whenever the two ticked me, like the, just the base damage of the two, whenever it ticked me... Um, I would lose a stack of Hide of the Nemean, and I'm 100% sure that's a glitch. That's definitely not supposed to be how it is, but... Damn it, dude. I knew he was going to be doing that shit, too. Man, how did he do so much? Eight autos did 1k. He must have crit. I know he has crit chance, by the way. But it's only 10%, so I didn't think he would he'd crit me. But I guess... I don't know. Phoenix did 500. I only hit him seven times. I don't know. Maybe that was just a really bad play. Probably just a really bad play, honestly. He gets my tower here, because he stole Bull Demon from me. This is um, going to be near impossible at this stage in the game. I mean, late game Hunter against Aokong. It really just ain't it, Chief. <laughs> so we're going to have to pull out a fucking miracle to make this work. But we'll see, we'll see. Oops. I appreciate this guy as a fan though. See Josh run. I wonder if he's playing while he's on a treadmill right now. There used to be this streamer that I followed named Barefoot Treadmill Gamer. Um, but I think he stopped streaming a long time ago. He would just walk on a treadmill the entire time he was playing. It was crazy. He'd walk like 20 miles a day. For no reason other than the fact that he wanted to. Nuts. Yo, I do no damage, bro. He heals it all up. Alright. And that was pretty much my entire two. And, um... Yeah, he just walked it off. That was super not cool.
right. Once again, I'm just alting the peel for myself, pretty much. That's it. I'm actually so fucking dead. He's not immediately at Bull Demon, which is good. I was really scared he was just going to be straight up at Bull Demon. I have to wait for this gold. There's a huge power spike for me, though, so I have to do it. Please be at wave. Please be at wave. Fuck, I think he went straight to Bull Demon. That's what I was scared of. <gasps> he went for red. Nice. Okay. That's very, very good. If he went for Bull Demon, I was, I was pissed off and annoyed. Thank God he didn't. He autoed me one time, and it crit. He's just outrunning me, so I'm just gonna... Nice. Yo, the Telekines did so much damage. Helikines did so much damage. Oh my god. Yo, Telekines is a huge ass power spike, man. Hmm. Well, good kill. Finally, he put the beads to use. He already dashed, so I'm pretty sure he just dies here. Oh, his dash came up quick. Malice doing work there. Bringing that cooldown real, real low. Does he have a lot of lifesteal? He literally doesn't have any, but I feel like his sustain is so high. But it could just be his 1, because I think his 1, when it's maxed out, is 15% lifesteal. But it could be 10%. It also could be 1%. I don't really know. But I think it's 15. Which is a pretty significant amount. Alright, so my mistake this game was definitely buying Demonic instead of Telekines. I had no idea Telekines was so much of a power spike on Ao Kuang. Nice. Nice. GG, bro. GG. Oh. GG, gamer. Um. Alright, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this full auto attack Al Kwong game. I really don't play Al Kwong, and I don't really ever claim to be good with him, but I hope that it wasn't super embarrassing for all the Al Kwong mains out there. Um, I bet the demonic over Telekines play was probably so cringeworthy for anyone who... That's so loud. That doesn't need to be that loud. Um, the demonic over Telekines play was probably super cringy for anyone who mains out Kong in Duel, but... Again, I'm sorry I don't play him that much, but I'm, you know, I'm down to try to learn him. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Thank you all for subscribing. Thank you all for purchasing the Into the AM shirts. I'm wearing another one today. I love these bitches. You'll probably catch me wearing them in almost every video. Um, I also have merch, which is one of the links in the description below, I'm sure. Or you could just click on the little icons. Um, yeah. All right. Thanks for watching. I love you all. Your support is amazing. You're fantastic. You're beautiful. And also, if nobody said it today, you're amazing. Keep on keeping on and fighting the good fight. Peace out.